So here with four effective tips to help you achieve the initial goal is the author of Living Your Best Life, Career and Life Satisfaction Expert, Laura Berman Fortgang. Laura, good morning to you. Good morning. Good morning. Uh, four pretty simple tips. So let's yes. start with the first one. Sure, we, we have to give up the past. I mean, the 209 was not a great year. And the sooner we can forget about it, the better. Because everyone says make lemonade out of lemons, but if you really want champagne, you don't want lemonade, right? right? So we have to just forget what it was and start building on how it is now. I also find the second tip very interesting because you say leverage what is already working. Explain that. Yeah, a lot of times we live in the gap of we want something else, but look at what's working. A lot of people had to make changes in the last year, and maybe it is working that dad stayed home, and he kind of likes it. So keep going with that. Or look for the opportunities that are coming now and leverage those regardless if they're ideal or not. So if you focus on what's working and build more of it, your happiness comes in, you feel more successful. Tip number three is? <laughs> Tip number three is correct. Just like the, the stock market corrects itself when it gets out of whack, we have to correct ourselves, meaning that maybe we had to give up something yeah. we really loved and we can bring it back in now. You know, things are changing, chaos is how we reorganize yep. ourselves. Yep. So you miss some people in your life or there's a skill you wanted to use or there's something from your past that you love to do, bring it into now. And now is an opportunity to make change. And finally, the fourth one is expect better outcomes. That's just being positive, positive attitude. Yeah, I mean, uh, you know, sometimes that's too Pollyanna-ish for people. So I like to look at it this way: prepare for the worst, but expect the best. Meaning, you know, have a have a plan for plan B, but focus on plan A. Expect it to work. Look at things, even if you're visualizing like the sports people do, something that's not here yet. Right. Focus on the positive because you're more likely to succeed than if you're worried and fearful and full of dread. And important to remember, one out of four Americans has a mental health disorder, so we should not uh, neglect the mental health as, as we focus on the physical. I think these tips are endorsed by both of our experts, <laughs> so we hope everyone can follow them. Thank you both.